Well, leading US trainer Wesley Ward, one thing about you, Wesley, you've never been afraid to travel your horses. No, I love these international events. They're fantastic, and uh, I've had a lot of success coming over, and just great. Wesley, you came to us last year and had instant success. Yeah, I, I really got lucky. You know, um, the ground was was firm, uh, which is what we have in America. We have a very fast going, and that's what the horses were used to. And we were really lucky that they didn't have any rain for some time here, and so the ground was really hard and fast, and and it sort of favored the horses that were up in the in the front. And which it, which mine are trained to do. And now you've got to run it tomorrow, but a uh, likely to scratch. It's a likely scratch. Uh, you know, we tried it. You know, we came all the way over here, and I spoke to some of my partners, and we were going to give it a go just as we went through this whole process. Um, but the horses were proven that they should be in the races. They won their previous starts in France by comfortable margins. Come out of the races great. Ran very fast times. But unfortunately for us, we had rain this week, and my horses have never even trained on uh, soft going, and they just couldn't handle it. And um, as I said, you haven't been afraid to travel in the past. How do you compare Ascot to some of the American carnivals? Like, for example, Breeders' Cup, is it comparable? I think it's bigger. This, this is an unbelievable place. Fantastic racetrack. Um, the, it's very exciting uh, to be here and to be at, at such a, a worldly event. And uh, you stable, you've got quite a few uh, celebrity owners. Tell us about a few of those. Yeah, uh, Wes Welker, a football player uh, for the New England Patriots. He owns a filly that ran yesterday. And uh, got a, another owner, Joe Pesci, a uh, big movie actor. And he has some broodmares with me and, and races uh, a lot of their progeny. And what's coming up for Wesley Ward? Do you continue to race over in Europe or uh, something bigger on the agenda? You never know. Um, I came over early this year, and uh, my first five runners I had uh, between England and France all won right off the plane, and so it, we had a lot of success, you know, running them right off the plane. The uh, problem is once once they're here, I think they can sort of bounce a little bit from to their second start. So you know, it's all a learning curve and a, and a learning process to where, you know, if I do come next year, it'll 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 probably be right off the plane and run, and then and then come back home.